Hey everybody, Rob from Hobby King here with a Tips Bench Tuesday quick tip. Mm. This video is going to describe how to connect the Trackstar 120 amp ESC um, Gen 2 to the program box and also then use the program box as a pass through to a PC and use the USB link software. There's been some, um, some folks who seem to have trouble doing this, so I'm going to walk you through it. It's simple and it does work. So first things first, we're going to connect the program box to the PC and regular USB micro cable. You gotta make sure you hear that sound, the deep dee dee If you don't hear that sound, that means that the cable you're using is not the proper one, okay? And when you connect properly with the proper cable, the PC will automatically download the drivers it needs to set this up. And uh, you can see now it says USB connected to PC. So then the next thing we're gonna do is um, we're going to connect the uh, ESC to the box. And you have to use a female to female lead, servo lead, okay? Connect it in this polarity, and we're gonna connect that to the box. I'll show you that in a moment. Oh. And I just bumped the uh, USB cable. All right, so you connect it in that polarity, so there's the connection, okay? You do not use this main lead. That's not what this is for. <laughs> and then um, we're going to connect power the ESC needs to be powered. You cannot just uh, use the USB power connection. You've got to power it. I'm using a uh, Rapid 2S pack here. All right, so connected to PC, groovy. So now we go over to the PC and we open the USB link software. This is version 2.06 and it is available in the manuals and files tab of the multi-function smart box and also the ESC itself. So if we look there, so this is for the this is the ESC's page and scroll down manuals and files right there. And to it, ugh, sorry, USB link software is available right there. Click to download, save it. Okay, we're in the software and now it says USB connected, which is good, but it says ESC disconnected, which is not good. We go to ESC default, reset all ESC data, yes. And now the ESC is connected, you can see there you go. And now you can go to all the different settings, okay? It saves automatically. If you get a firmware update issue, the first thing that'll pop up is it'll it'll show up, it would be right here. So, yeah. So what you can do is you can go to upgrade and just upgrade the your versions. Uh, this is the ESC is at 2.07. The box is at 2.02. .02. It did it automatically for me. So that should uh, that should get you going, all right? So I hope all this helps and um, let me know.